All right, y'all, I'm back on the vlog, man. We getting ready to uh, We stop past the damn 18 right quick. And uh, we getting ready to go on down the road to the damn sports store, man. And, uh, we're going to pick up parts and get this thing in good shape, man. Get a good running shape, man. See what I'm saying? So, look, I'm going to touch back in with y'all when I damn get over here to the parts store and pull up the filming. All right, y'all, we just made it down here to the parts store, man. We're going to get to the parts, man, and then uh, I'm going to chime back in. All right, guys, I know it probably seems like I'm all over the place right about now, but um, I started. I'm uh, Right now, I just uh, opened the filter cabin, man, and checked it out. I'm going to clean it out, and I checked the filter, and uh, it's need to replace Next thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and pull pull the uh, plugs and check them, see if they need replaced. They're in a real bad situation. I'm going to go ahead and replace them. I don't know. Uh, see here, I got the oil. Shout out to O'Reilly for a good price on the oil and uh, oil filter and uh, air filter. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to uh, Michael Guard. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Stanley too, because that's what we're getting down with today. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, I'm going to chime back in and get something else, another task done and chime back in. That one different size. Right. See, I got that coil off there, but uh, when I look down in that plug, that plug looks halfway um, clean or new. So I'm pull it still and check it out. And uh, if we don't need plugs, we just go without the plugs. Okay, guys, I pulled the plug out. I got the, I got the plug loose. All right, there goes the plug. All right, guys, uh, check this out. If you're watching this video, I want you to go down in the... Uh, comment section and let me know what it means when you see oil on the plugs. Alright, so we got oil on this plug right here. Alright. Alright guys, at this point we're going to just go ahead and replace each one of the plugs with some other lights. Uh, shout out to all the lights, man. And uh, I'm going to just go ahead and replace um, the plugs, all of them, and do all the change like I was playing, essentially. Alright guys, so we're going to start with new plugs and um, like I said, we're going to get them in there and get it going, you feel me? When you put them on there, you want to put them there by hand, make sure you don't um, cross thread them. Make sure they're in there straight. Hand tighten first. Tighten it, just snug it, not over tight. You don't want it to spin off in the engine, you know what I'm saying? All right, so um, I did disconnect the uh, one of the coils. This is one of the things I had to disconnect. So we're going to plug the coil back and uh, plug, plug, pull the plug up to the socket right here. And then um, we we repeat the process with the other three left. All right, guys. Uh, starting from the left, the second cylinder, which is this hole right here. Um, when I pull the plug, man, um, 
It was pretty clean and wasn't oily on like the other, the first one that we did, so that's a good sign. So, alright, I'm gonna just go ahead and change it anyway. Like I said, I was gonna change them all out and we continue on, on with the video. And uh, if you're liking the video this far, man, make sure to like, share, comment, subscribe, put on the post notification bell. So that way when I drop content, man, you'll be able to uh, get a notification and be able to tune in, you know, and not miss my videos so forth, man. So, uh, yeah, so what's up? All right, guys, we made it to the last one right here. That one that's smoking. It's, uh, this plug just came out there on that one. It's got a pretty good bit of oil on there. So starting from the left to the right, the very last one. Like I said um, earlier in the video, man, um, if somebody know what a whole lot of oil, man, on the plug, uh, put it down in the comment section. Get at me. Yeah, man. So uh, we're going to continue and put the last one in. Then uh, probably drop the uh, air filter and change it all, then we'll be good. See this screw right here? This ain't even the rest. This this screw right here ain't even the uh the size is the rest of them. These right here are different. Right here. Yeah. Now this is the last one we gonna um put down here and try to get up in there and get the oil changed and um put that little filter in over there. And now we done for this little video today. Till we find another project. guys while I was uh, doing this uh, tune up uh, maintenance service I decided to also clean out the uh, travel body with some my uh, injection cleaner uh, so that's another thing I wanted to add I take care of now I'm getting ready to put all that stuff together and like I said you know try and do everything I can to make it run smooth as uh, when we're done All right, now we got everything put back under the hood. So uh, we're going ahead and drain the oil, which is uh, probably the first thing I should have done, but it's all good. I wanted to uh, get the maintenance done, and uh, we're going to drain the oil and put the oil back in, and we're good and ready to go. All right, y'all, uh, as you can see, uh, I'm already uncovered the top, and I'm about to put the oil in the motor and change the oil filter. Uh, for those of you got an Altima, it's about uh, 2005 or so. That filter is down there, right in line with my finger. You can't really see it, but it's black in color. Right about there, and it's black in color. If you can see it. But maybe you can't. But uh, you had to get to it from the bottom. But it's all good. So I'm put the oil in, man. We can crank it up and see what's up. All right, guys. So I uh, checked the oil, and it's had. I wiped it, but I'm just pulling it right now. But it's got uh, 
plenty enough where I, where I change the oil right there. So clean that oil is. And uh, when I crank the motor up, after changing the oil and the plugs, um, it uh, just starts smoking like crazy. I don't know guys, it's supposed to smoke like that.